Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome, welcome. And Happy New Year! Um, so today I am going to go through my TBCs that I picked out for January. Um, I will leave all the links uh, for everything down below in the description in case you see something you want to check out. So I'm just going to jump right in. I'm going to start with the biggest book so we can kind of get that over. Uh, and I want to do a page out of vitro number two. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice is a little weird today. Um, and this is such a cute book. And I want to do this page over here, the cute little Dumbo. Um, the prompt for January is, um, elephant. So I figured it'd be cute to do Dumbo. Um, so yeah, I don't know what I would use, um, because this is, uh, this is pretty decent paper, so I can use pretty much whatever. Um, so yeah, that's from Vitro 2. Then I've got Daydreams by Hannah Carlson. And let's see, let's just zoom in a little bit see oh maybe that's a bit too much like so and let's see I picked out a page from here somewhere let's see I think I'm gonna try to get this page done um, I think this one would look pretty cool with like watercolors uh, maybe some pencil on top <clears throat> um, so yeah that's what I want to do in here Then I've got Twilight Garden by Maria Trolle, and let's see, I picked out, well, I want to finish this page. I started it with museums, and then, um, let's see, then I want to do this cute little fox over here, so hopefully I can get those two done. Uh, this is one of my favorite pages in the whole book. I think it's just so cute. So, yeah. Those are the ones I want to do in there. Then I've got Moya Kibiti uh, by, you know, uh, this person, Petra, um, something. And I still haven't finished this one, so I want to finish that. And I'm using uh, Derwent Lightfast and Luminance on this one. Uh, pretty happy with how it's coming out. Um, so yeah, hopefully I can get that one done. We've been working on that one on stream. Um, then I've got her other book too. Uh, Sedmik Vitek. And um, I want to do this rose here. I think this is just so pretty. This is the one that I was... Um, I was gonna I was gonna start this one um, like on my own but then I went with that Moya Kviti page instead <clears throat> so maybe I can get this one done it's not it's not you know it's not huge I just wanted to kind of color a page in this I've got a lot of uh, the books that I've got for Christmas on my TBC so uh, then I've got Mouse Guard which I haven't colored in this book in forever. Um, and I want to do this page over here. I think it's a really cute page. I know it's very like, it's like an autumn page. Um, but I, I really like this one. So I'm going to try to do that. And uh, I think it'll look really cool with maybe like graphitant um, or something because of it's so dark already that it might look I think it might look nice with some graphitins or something so there's that from mouse guard then i've also got the flower fairies um let's see this is by frederick warren and let's see i want to do this page i think she's just adorable 
and I don't know what I would use. Maybe I'd try out some different pencils because it will be my first page in this book. So I might try out some different things and see what I like in here. Um, so yeah, there's that from the Flower Fairies. Then I've got another book I haven't colored in in forever. <clears throat> and that's the Ink House. And this lion here is the only page I've colored in this book. Um, and I want to do this page with the elephant. Um, I don't know what I would use. Maybe graphitins again. I, I'm kind of like, I'm feeling the graphitins lately. So, I think, because, you know, elephants are such, you know, they're, they're very neutral in color and all that. So maybe graphitins would look cool on this page too. Um... Maybe some other stuff too. So yeah, hopefully I can get this one done. This will also be for the elephant prompt. Um, and the elephant prompt is something that Shannon Shannon does over on her channel every month. Not just the elephant prompt. There's a different prompt every month. Um, and I kind of pick some pages <clears throat> based on the prompt. It's a lot of fun. Makes you kind of look through your books and, you know discover pages that you normally wouldn't um then i've got anamorphia which is it's by kirby rosans and i've had this book for years and i've never finished a page in it so i thought maybe it was time so i picked out not that page let me see here i found an elephant so hopefully I can do this one. This will probably be with like um, Neo 2 base with maybe some pencils on top, I think. Um, definitely, definitely not all pencils, I think. But maybe some, some Neo 2s for a base and then maybe Prismas or, or something on top. Um, and his, his older books has a lot of the... Uh, the text up here where you know it says you know to finish the page or whatever I just ignore that I'll just color it as is so there's uh, that one from Anamorphia and then I done lost my mind and my last book is Phantomorphia also by Kirby so I guess we're doing two Kirby's in January and I want to do this page here because I really like this page it's the This Book Belongs To page. I might, if I'm even crazier, I might do this one at the same time. Um, I got this book for Christmas and I figured uh, maybe I'll just do the, uh, the, the little, you know, This Book Belongs To page. I think it looks really cool. So, so yeah, that is all the pages I picked out for... January. Goodness me, I forgot what month we were in. Um, you know, I'll probably do some other ones too, because I don't usually always only stick to uh, to my TBC. Uh, but it's just like a, a guide. You know, if you don't really know what to color, you already have something picked out that you can look through. Um, I find that that helps a lot, at least for me, picking pages. Because uh, it takes me sometimes hours and hours and hours of looking through books so this this way i already have like a <clears throat> something to to look through if i just want to find something to color um but yeah anyways thank you guys so much for watching i hope you have a great rest of your day and i will see you guys in the next one bye guys toodaloo